It's real trauma card cribbing I'm back with another one. Huge shout out to everybody watching this video. And if you aren't subscribed, make sure you smash that subscribe button. I'm here to give you an update about the fix and flip. So as you guys can see at the floor, brand new flooring. The floor is not buckled up anymore. We got that nice to take care of. Also brand new paint, all white with the accent wall to match the flooring, to match the font's way. Now, last one, we didn't, last video, we didn't even have cabinets in. We have the cabinets in. We also have the countertops. Excuse the mess, we're still working. We also put a brand new stove right in here. The other one was terrible. And let's go outside. This is gonna be quick and sweet, just to give you guys an update. And once we're fully finished, I'm gonna give you a last update. So, we have our friends over here. It's always barking at us. It's about three of them. But the deck was completely terrible. So what we did was power wash this, scrubbed it down. It took four days to actually do this and painted it black. Very, very nice touch. And we also put the lattice down here to make it look very nice. Oh, gotta take that screen in. Look at the lattice. Very, very nice storage. You put the barbecue grill, whatever you want to put down here. Kids for the toy, I mean, toys for the kids and everything for the summer. Put that lattice on there. Got it looking righteous. And actually it wasn't that expensive. It probably cost about two or $300 all together. Now, I want to see you guys inside. I'm going to show you the bathrooms and we got the brand new carpet. We got a few more updates. Let's go ahead and step into the hallway. We did change the pantry door. Oh yeah. Put the new shelves in there too. It's kind of match, huh? Nice little touch. Then we have red room number one, brand new carpet, brand new paint. Nice and clean. Nice and clean. That's what we're going for. Nice and clean. Bathroom number one. Put the brand new floor in here. We painted the vanity. It came out excellent. We still, we painted the countertop too on the vanity. We still have to wait one more day to put the faucet in there, but it's very, very, that's kind of came out excellent. Painted the grout, put brand new shower head, brand new faucet, nice and clean. The master suite, brand new carpet, brand new paint. Have to put the handles on for that. I'm liking this, I'm liking it, I'm liking it, I'm liking it. It's way better than it was before. Now we're gonna go ahead and step downstairs. Oh, we have to put the handles on all the brand new cabinets, brand new, brand new, brand new. We placed the phone on the stairs, they used to be dark brown. Brand new lock. Black door. Gotta switch it up, baby. Brand new carpet on the stairs. This is my favorite room in the house. The family room. This is where we, you can put a pool table, you can put the, the, the whole setup, the family gathering setup right there. But I really like how we separated that. We were gonna do just the whole wall, but I'm like, we should just separate it. Give it a, like, a nice little touch. Excellent job in here. Brand new carpet in also. Now, the laundry room. We're debating about this because we are over budget. We already know we're over budget. But do we paint the flooring in this laundry room? It's ladies and gentlemen, for the men who wash their clothes, is this a deal breaker? I need you guys to come below and let me know. If this floor is not painted, would you say, no, I'm not buying this house? Or does it, I mean, it's all about preference. Is it that, is it, is it that, is it that big of a deal? Me, I have a problem with overpaying stuff, so I just like to do too much. That's the thing about flipping houses, you have to keep staying, try to stay in your budget as much as possible and not go overboard, I have a problem. It's not, I'm not gonna be the one living here, somebody else is, but I need you guys to comment below and let me know. If you were looking to buy a house, would that be a deal breaker? Room number three, brand new carpet, brand new paint. I thought about doing the same thing as the family room, but you know, no, I decided not to. Bathroom number two. This bathroom was pretty much done already. We had to do a little bit thing. This was, it was a leak down here. We had to put that nice and clean, put that brand new bottom in there. Everything else, caulk a little bit. Everything else is pretty much done here. Room number four, we in the door. Brand new carpet, brand new paint. And look at the view. Look 
Look at the vast lands. Oh, we have to change some screens out too. I forgot about that. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Again, make sure you comment below and let me know. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you would have changed, what you would have kept. Let me know what you would have done. We do have a, a few more things that we need to do. And I'm going to give you the last final video on the next video. But for anyone who's looking to buy or sell any property, you can always email me at romeshousereviews at gmail.com. I'll see you guys on the next one. It's Real to Rome, and I'm gone.